According to The Hill, the video sharing site also removed a video from a Senate committee hearing in which Johnson, quote, discussed experimental treatments for COVID-19 like hydroxychloroquine and ivermectin. YouTube says the two drugs are included in the company's COVID-19 medical misinformation policy. YouTube has now banned Johnson from uploading new videos for at least seven days. In response, the senator from Wisconsin took to Twitter saying, quote, YouTube's arrogant COVID censorship continues. How many lives will be lost as a result? How many lives could have been saved with a free exchange of medical ideas? The suppression of speech should concern every American.